There's something magical about old Hollywood actresses. They are the epitome of glamour and have always looked great on screen. Even when they weren't on TV, they were still style icons. Several of them starred in some of the most iconic films of all time. From Ursula Andress to Marilyn Monroe, here are the top 30 most beautiful actresses of the golden age of Hollywood who will make your heart smile. Number 1. Ursula Andress Back in 1962, Sean Connery's legendary performance as the suave and charming spy James Bond shocked the world. In every movie, the MI6 agent meets and connects with one lucky girl, and Ursula Andress was one of them. In fact, the actress was the first Bond girl. Because of her Swiss-German accent, Andress's voice was actually dubbed in the movie. But that didn't stop her from becoming one of Hollywood's most famous actresses of all time. She later worked for Playboy magazine and posed for some very provocative photos. In the 1960s, it was a pretty daring thing to do. Number 2. Vivian Lee. Vivian Lee was one of the few actresses who could say that her biggest flaw was that she was too beautiful. People didn't pay much attention to the young, talented star's acting skills because they were more interested in how she looked. Her most famous movie roles were in Gone with the Wind and A Streetcar Named Desire, two of the most famous and legendary movies of the 20th century. The actress and performer died in 1967 from tuberculosis, but her Hollywood career is still remembered today. Number 3. Sharon Tate Sharon Tate fans will always remember how tragic her story was. The talented and beautiful actress had a hard life, which included marrying the famous director and fugitive sex offender Roman Polanski. In 1969, members of the Manson family brutally killed Tate. The actress was almost nine months pregnant when she died, which makes her story even sadder. She is still talked about in the entertainment industry, and people remember her for her stunning beauty, amazing acting skills, and terrible ending. Number 4. Lauren Bacall Even though many women look beautiful, not all of them have seductive voices. Lauren Bacall was the 20th century's greatest female classic Hollywood star. In 1996, she won an Oscar for her performance in The Mirror Has Two Faces. The actress was a liberal Democrat who used her fame to support political issues. She was also a model, and her pictures often appeared in popular magazines like Harper's Bazaar and Vogue. The actress died in the middle of 2014, a month before she turned 90. Number 5. Barbara Eden Barbara Eden was born in 1931, and she is still popular in Hollywood. The actress is famous for playing Jeannie in the sitcom I Dream of Jeannie. Eden played a 2,000-year-old Jeannie who falls in love with an astronaut. Rumor has it that the show's creators wanted a brunette at first, so that viewers could easily tell the show apart from the popular fantasy sitcom Bewitched, which was the sitcom's biggest rival at the time. But they couldn't resist Eden and had to give her the part. Number 6. Claudia Cardinal you might remember Claudia Cardinale from the original Pink Panther movie from 1963. She is an Italian-Tunisian actress who was in some of Europe's best-reviewed movies in the 1960s and 1970s. She first became famous as, quote, the most beautiful Italian girl in Tunisia. Early on in her career, the actress's voice was often dubbed by other women. Fans eventually wanted to hear it because she became so famous. Cardinal is a passionate advocate for women's rights and has been a UNESCO Goodwill Ambassador since 2000. Number 7. Anita Ekberg Fans of the beautiful actress Margot Robbie often compare her to Anita Ekberg, a Swedish actress best known for playing Sylvia in Federico Fellini's 1960 film La Dolce Vita. The actress was also a fashion model when she was young, which isn't very surprising. She competed in several modeling contests, including Miss Malmo and Miss Sweden, both of which she won. In 1951, Ekberg even became Miss Universe. From there, she had to learn English if she wanted to be an actress in America. She died in 2015 at the age of 83. Number 8. Jacqueline Smith 
It's not often that you see a woman with as much experience as Jacqueline Smith in so many different areas. Smith is both a professional actress and a serious businesswoman. She is most famous for playing Kelly Garrett on the TV show Charlie's Angels, which ran from 1976 to 1981. The actress has her own lines of clothing, perfume, and wigs, which she started selling in 2008. Even though she has done a lot, Jacqueline Smith is best known for her incredible beauty. She is often voted world's most beautiful woman by readers of magazines. Number 9. Natalie Wood Natalia Nikolaevna Zaharenko was nominated for three Oscars before she turned 25. She was one of the most promising actresses in Hollywood. The actress was born to Russian immigrants, and she started acting when she was only four years old. In Rebel Without a Cause, which also featured James Dean, the actress played one of the main characters. Sadly, both she and that actor later died in tragic ways. After a weekend boat cruise to Santa Catalina with her husband Robert Wagner and actor Christopher Walken, Wood drowned at the age of 43. Number 10. Sophie Marceau Sophie Marceau is a French actress best known for starring in the 1980 comedy La Bonne. The actress eventually became a big star in European theaters, and she was quickly noticed in Hollywood. Marceau acted in Braveheart and was a Bond girl in 1990's The World Is Not Enough. Sophie Marceau is usually on the lists of the most beautiful women. But Marceau doesn't see what all the fuss is about and says that from her point of view, she's really not that beautiful at all. With all due respect, Sophie, we agree to disagree. Number 11. Ava Gardner Ava Lavinia Gardner had to work very hard to become an actress because people often misunderstood her strong southern accent. She started acting in 1941, but it wasn't until 1946's The Killers, based on a short story by Ernest Hemingway, that she became famous. From then on, Gardner's career only got better, and in 1951, she even married the famous Frank Sinatra. Unfortunately, the actress became paralyzed as a result of a lifetime of smoking and two strokes. Gardner died at age 67 from pneumonia, but she is still remembered as a Hollywood legend. Number 12. Julie Gibson Julie Gibson recently died in her Los Angeles home at the incredible age of 106. You can definitely say that the artist, singer, TV performer, actress, and vocal coach had a full life. Gibson's acting career started in 1935 and lasted well into the 1990s. In the 1940s, the actress was one of the most popular people in Hollywood and in America as a whole. Her most famous role was on the popular comedy show The Three Stooges. Gibson also did vocal overdubs for famous actresses of the time, like Betty Hutton and Diana Lynn. Number 13. Audrey Hepburn British actress Audrey Hepburn co-starred with Gregory Peck in the film Roman Holiday, for which she was nominated for and won a Golden Globe, a British Academy Film Award, and the Academy Award. Many people also looked to the actress as a style icon. Hepburn was recently named by the American Film Institute as the third greatest female actress of the golden age of Hollywood. She lost her battle with stomach cancer in 1993, but her legacy as an actress and social activist lives on. Number 14. Michelle Pfeiffer At 64, actress Michelle Pfeiffer is still one of Hollywood's most beautiful women. She has been in a huge number of movies, including Scarface, Stardust, and many others. In the 1970s, it was hard for her to break out of the, quote, pretty girl stereotype, but it was worth the effort. People have often said that Michelle Pfeiffer's beauty is the kind that makes you stop and look in awe, and we still think that's true. The actress has also made her own movies and is still acting and being admired by a huge number of fans today. Number 15. Hedy Lamarr Hedy Lamarr was a famous Austrian-American actress. She was in many classic MGM movies, including Lady of the Tropics, Boomtown, and White Cargo. At age 18, the actress appeared in the romantic movie Ecstasy. She was the first actress to have an orgasm on screen. What made Lamar special was that in addition to being an actress, she was also an inventor. 
She came up with many ideas that helped the U.S. win World War II, and she was inducted into the National Inventors Hall of Fame in 2014. She was also married and divorced six times in her lifetime. Number 16. Grace Kelly There is a long history of beautiful American actresses marrying royalty from different countries. Grace Kelly was an actress for a few years before she quit at 26 to marry Prince Rainier III. She then became the Princess of Monaco and held that title from 1956 to 1982. The talented actress and princess had a very sad ending, though. She was driving back to Monaco from her country home in Roc Agel when she had a stroke and lost control of her vehicle. Kelly died that day and had one of the most talked about funerals in the world. Number 17. Jacqueline Bissett During the 1960s and 1970s, Jacqueline Bissett became famous for her roles in crime and thriller films. The English-born actress speaks English, French, and Italian fluently, and she was recently given the Légion d'Honneur, France's highest civilian honor. Today, Bissette mostly acts in made-for-TV movies and shows. In the movie The Deep from 1977, Jacqueline Bissette wore a wet t-shirt for the first time ever on film. The film is still one of the actress's most famous works. It was a bold move at the time, and it made the movie a huge box office hit. Number 18. Elizabeth Taylor Elizabeth Taylor was one of Hollywood's last true stars. The actress was the first celebrity to develop her own perfume line and spearheaded various AIDS prevention campaigns. Taylor led a unique life that was centered on the media. She was married and divorced eight times. Even so, nobody could get enough of the actress. She started her career as a child star and quickly became one of the world's most famous actresses. In 1999, the American Film Institute ranked Taylor the seventh greatest female movie legend. Her eye color is still debated by fans. Number 19. Anne Margaret Olsen Anne Margaret was one of the most famous sex symbols of the 1960s and 1970s. She is best known for the 1963 musical comedy Bye Bye Birdie, for which she won five Golden Globe Awards. Anne Margaret's acting career has grown over the years, and she has played recurring characters on Ray Donovan and Law & Order SVU. Even at 81, she is still seen as a beautiful and attractive woman, which goes a long way towards showing how timeless her beauty is. Number 20. Isabella Rossellini Isabella Rossellini, the beautiful daughter of Ingrid Bergman, who is also on this list, proved that apples do not fall far from trees. Swedish-German heritage gave the actress a unique appearance. She is an actress, director, writer, model, and philanthropist. Rossellini has been in fashion shows, modeling magazines, and movies. Lancome's spokesmodel for 14 years, she earned the Independent Spirit Award for Best Female Lead in 1997's Blue Velvet. Fans love Rosalini for both her amazing talent and her beauty. Number 21. Kim Basinger Kim Basinger has been a strong actress in Hollywood for almost 50 years, thanks to her unique acting skills and ageless beauty. The actress became famous after she played a Bond girl in the 1979 movie Never Say Never Again. Basinger was also in the 2017 film Fifty Shades Darker. She has been in movies ranging from erotica to Tim Burton's Batman, and she is still acting today. Basinger's beautiful blue eyes, perfect face, and long flowing blonde hair make her easy to spot. Number 22. Barbara Parkins when young Canadian Barbara Parkins asked her adoptive mother to move with her to Los Angeles, she agreed. The 16-year-old then started on a long journey toward becoming a movie star. She started by going to Hollywood High School and built her career from there. Parkins first put herself out there as a professional singer, but it didn't take long for people to realize that she was also a talented actress. She was nominated for an Emmy when she was only 24, and she kept acting well into her 70s. The actress stopped working in 1998, but she will always be remembered for her beauty and talent. Number 23. Sophia Loren Most people remember Sophia Loren for her strong feminist statements, like not shaving her armpits. 
but her beauty and acting skills also won her a lot of fans. Loren started acting when she was 14 years old, and she's still doing it today, well into her 80s. A Countess from Hong Kong, The Pride and the Passion, and Grumpier Old Men are some of the actress's most well-known movies. Loren has won an Oscar, a Grammy, five special Golden Globes, and many more awards. Number 24. Jane Birkin Jane Birkin became famous because she was with Serge Gainsbourg, one of the most famous and important French singers and songwriters for 10 years. She also had a very successful acting career in both British and French movies. Gainsbourg often helped her improve her performance. The actress starred in popular films and TV episodes, including Death on the Nile, Evil Under the Sun, and A Soldier's Daughter Never Cries. Birkin recently acted in the Academy Award-nominated short film La Femme et la TGV, saying that it would be her last role. Number 25. Raquel Welch Before the media and moviegoers started noticing Raquel Welch, it was definitely an uphill battle. She started out with small parts, but when she was in the movie One Million Years B.C. and wore her famous fur bikini, she became famous. From there, the young actress went on to star in several more popular movies, such as 1967's Be Dazzled, 1968's Bandolero, and 1969's 100 Rifles. Welch's main contribution to Hollywood was making strong female characters more popular and changing how men and women were treated. Number 26. Rita Hayworth Rita Hayworth is best known for being one of Hollywood's most famous sex icons of the 1940s and 1950s. She was the most popular pinup girl for soldiers during World War II. The press called her a, quote, love goddess. Hayworth's most well-known role was in the 1964 movie Gilda, in which she played one of the first femme fatales in Hollywood. Throughout her life, the model and actress had to deal with problems like alcoholism and Alzheimer's. She died in the late 1980s, but people will always remember how beautiful and skilled she was. Number 27. Catherine Deneuve Catherine Deneuve became famous after her first roles in Les Paraplis de Schauburg and Repulsion by Roman Polanski. She was nominated for 14 César Awards and sometimes worked as a singer, model, and producer. She is still working and has been in more than 100 movies. Deneuve was also admired for how beautiful she was, and she was chosen to be the face of Marianne, the French symbol of freedom. The actress has always been interested in politics, and she recently spoke out against the Me Too movement, calling it a witch hunt. Number 28. Loretta Young Loretta Young was destined to be an actress from the start. She got her first part when she was only three years old. She was in the silent movie Sweet Kitty Belairs, and she kept acting well into the 1990s. The actress died in August 2000 when she was 87 years old. During her seven-decade career, Young was in almost 100 different movies. She was known for being beautiful and a great actress. The actress started smoking when she was just eight years old and kept doing so well into her 60s. She stopped smoking in the end so that she could put on a few pounds for a role. Number 29. Charlize Theron Charlize Theron, a South African-born American actress and producer who took the world by storm in the 21st century, is one of the youngest people on our list. Even though she grew up in a home where she was abused, the aspiring ballet dancer made it into film and Hollywood circles. In 1994, talent agent John Crosby saw Charlize Theron yelling at a Hollywood bank teller who wouldn't cash her mother's rent check. This is how he found out about her. The rest of the story is old news, since Theron went on to become one of the most popular and well-known actresses in the world. Number 30. Marilyn Monroe No list of the world's most beautiful women is complete without Marilyn Monroe. This young woman was born in Los Angeles in the 1920s. When she grew up, she became one of the most famous sex symbols of the 1950s and early 1960s. Her short time as an actress brought in more than $2 billion. The model, actress, and singer died when she was just 36 years old. She had a hard life that was filled with depression and drug use, which led to her sad death. 
Monroe was also known as the pioneer of the sexual revolution among women, and she will always be seen as its icon. These actresses definitely rose to the top with good looks and tons of talent, and they stayed there. Hollywood's golden age was indeed filled with many talented actresses, and just as many were known for their exquisite beauty. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.